And that's what he brings to the table. Gain of 12, first down Indiana. Pass is complete. That's Ty Freifogel. Field in a third and nine situation. Ramsey again back to throw to the sideline. Pass is connect to Ty Freifogel. It's like one Freifogel. Third and 14. Ramsey spun all the way around after the snap. Pass complete. Ty Fry Fogel for the first down. Tough like a guy in the world, but he's tough. He has a savvy about him, and that's what makes this offense, IU offense go. Fry Fogel has the catch. Knocked down at the 10 yard line. Ramsey on third and six. There's a flag. This is going to be a hold on Indiana. So for the moment, Fry Fogel has the first down, but it should be coming back. Ramsey hit as he throws it, and another third down conversion. Indiana three for three, and they go to number three, Ty Fry Fogel. Pressure off the edge. Complete, wide open. Ty Fry Fogel. Inside the 30, and yet again, Indiana converts. Interestingly, they did not turn it over last week in that lopsided loss to Buffalo. Ramsey on the run, and he's got it to Ty Freifogel. Pushed out right around the marker, they'll say. Indiana needs three. And they've got three to number three, Ty Freifogel. Inside the Rutgers, 40 to the 38. To the sideline and complete. Finds Ty Freifogel. Empty backfield for Peyton Ramsey. Freifogel in stride, and he's got enough for the first down. But right now, Indiana's in business with Stevie Scott in the backfield. Ramsey looking for six into the end zone. They're wrestling for a touchdown. Ty Freifogel. Four, six, three. Freifogel, six, two. But I'll tell you what, that is some concentration. Secures the football. Game. And who would think C.J. Beathard be starting at quarterback for the 49ers and his boy Kittles <laughs> is the leading receiver on the 49ers as well with 23 catches. They're a very close game. Northwestern still in the mix there as well. The throw downfield reaching back to catch it is Freifogel. And both swung and missed on Hendershot. First down to 10. Panics a throw. And a complete Freifogel has first down yardage down to the 20-yard line. Critical for them to start tackling a little better tonight against Stevie Scott this offense. Left side and kind of a poor throw trying to find Freifogel there. He does really well is keep those eyes down the field on receivers. He's always trying to extend plays to throw. And so here, and he finds the end zone tie Freifogel. His second touchdown catch this year, good for 37 yards. And they've been able to take advantage of some mismatches there now for a Minnesota secondary that has had their share of issues. They've been better for the most part of tonight, but over the course of Big Ten play. I kind of wonder about... With time, back to the man who got him there, Fry Fogel. Catches the two-point conversion. Indiana making some noise One just over 10 minutes to play. And Matt Canada is one of, men, one of his mentors, the late Terry Hepner, taught him it's okay to have a little fun coaching football and playing football. First play out of the first series here for Indiana. Love to hit these crossing routes on the third down. Ramsey floating it high, going deep in the pass, connect with Fry Fogel. Ty Fry Fogel making the play on the outside for Indiana. Causing Michigan fits right now. Indiana quickly to the line of scrimmage. Ramsey rolls out underneath. First down, IU. Ty Fry Fogel. Ramsey to the corner. Touchdown, Indiana. Ty Fry Fogel. 
What a route by Ty Fry Fogel. Excellent job of going back to his right shoulder. Ramsey puts it right where he needs to. In all, L.A., 8 Eastern. All the eyes go to Notre Dame now with that Michigan potential loss. Ramsey fires. Jump ball, and the jump ball is brought down by Try Fry, Ty Fry Vogel. With plenty of protection, he'll fire. That one's complete. Try Vogel. Knocked out of bounds. First down yardage. Eastern Illinois rushes three, plenty of time. Penix underneath for Fry Fogel. Fry Fogel diving to the five, wrapped up by Caputo. Yeah, from Avon High School, just west of Indianapolis, about an hour away. First and ten at the 39. Ramsey over the middle. Another completion. Fry Fogel down to the 20. Walker now in in the slot position for Indiana. Ramsey scans the field. It connects with Fry Fogel. Second and ten. Ramsey to his right. And finds Ty Fry Fogel. Omar Fort making the tackle. Ramsey looking to his left to Ty Fry Fogel. Didn't have enough. Tragically, life was cut short. He's a good football coach heading in the end on the right direction. Out to Fry Fogel. And so far, the last two runs by Stevie Scott have been impressive. And here's a flag as the defense jumps. Quick throw out to Ty Fry Fogel, and he hauls it in around the 25. And Pennix right now, 20 of 24. And another completion, he's 21 and 25 as he finds Ty Freifogel down to the 10. It'll be first and goal. Here's Penix back to throw. Slings it out for the first catch for Ty Freifogel. Freifogel in motion. It's Penix this time to throw for the first time. Going fade out, going up to get it. Touchdown, Indiana. Yeah, this is a double move by Freifogel. Look, a little hitch and a little go. Throws it on the back shoulder on Avery Young. Ramsey to Freifogel. Picked up his first touchdown of the year for Freifogel. That'll be the last play of the quarter. Toward the sideline, he's got Ty Freifogel. Makes the catch, hangs on to it. On first down at 15, it's Ramsey with Scott beside him. Ramsey rolls and throws on the run. He has Freifogel again with a first down before he's nudged out of bounds. Picks up another five yards with three guys on his back. Big play there by Stevie Scott. Ramsey to the air on first down. Another long throw is complete to Ty Freifogel. Tom Allen took the timeout, second down and eight. Peyton Ramsey rolls, he fires, and he's got his man. That's Ty Freifogel right near the sticks toward the 40. Pocket clean and a big first down to quiet this crowd and get Indiana into Nebraska territory, first catch of the game. Ramsey going for the end zone, back pile on, and it is caught by Ty Freifogel. 9.57 to go in the third as Ramsey fires that complete to Ty Freifogel, had the touchdown earlier. Practicing really well, playing well today. He's going deep here, looking for Freifogel. Freifogel hauls it in. But here they decide to on second and 20, and Freifogel goes up over the 6-3. Yeah, there's no question about it. They take pride in it, and that's pretty special. First time ever. 
complete. Fry Vogel. Hey, I didn't hear the whistle, all those kind of things. No reason to slam a player down to the ground at a point like that. That pass is complete. Fry Vogel makes the catch. Ramsey again through the air. Wide open. Fry Vogel. Empty on third down against a very good third down defense. Ramsey wants the sideline and he's got it on target to tie Fry Fogle in a much needed big play for Indiana. Blitz picked up. Ramsey down the middle. Wide open. Fry Fogle touchdown. Nobody in the zip code. They brought a blitz from the left side and Ramsey protected comes right back. A bust on the back end. Peyton Ramsey. Has a first and 15. And he steps up to fire to Freifogel, who had the touchdown earlier. Quint, what's the story on failure? Ramsey loads it up to the sideline. He's got Freifogel for another first down. The evil for Indiana together. Ramsey loads it up. Sideline, Freifogel, wide open inside the 10 not possible in the middle of the field ignoring the outside receiver and there you go the number one passing team in the big 10 michigan one of the best pass defense teams in the country the throw on target to ty fry fogel just outside the red zone on second and four and that appears to be a first down on another completion to Ty Freifogel. That's awesome. Peyton Ramsey, weird looking RPO, but it works out. Ty Freifogel chopped down, but not before he got the first down. And now he is slow to get up. I mean, that's, you know, that's what is, I think, you the positive thing to build on. Ramsey on target. It's Ty Freifogel again. Peyton Hendershot back in the game at tight end. And they swing it out once again on that short pass. It's Ty Freifogel. Ramsey steps up and delivers. Complete for a first down to Ty Freifogel. It's a pickup of 20. The passing game has been on point this half. Going deep on the first play. What a grab and an Indiana first down, Ty Freifogel. See Freifogel on the slot, he's got off coverage, but it's man, that inside fade so hard to defend. Looking for Freifogel, who makes the catch. Now a thousand yards for his career. Marquise Wilson was there. Penix sets his feet on target to Fry Bogle, wrapped up quickly as uh, Trey Avery always is looking to strip the ball. Lined up in the pistol behind Penix. Play action. Fry Bogle, nice catch, but he's wrapped up by Trey Avery. That's shy of the goal line. Second and nine. Penix out of the gun. And fires. He's got his man. Fry Fogel. Touchdown. A string of unanswered points. Yeah, Penix. No pressure. See the ball's thrown a little bit behind. In the second quarter, especially. Rutgers rallying has made it 23 15. Penix over the middle. Shoots one there for Fry Fogel complete. First drive of the day starts at the 26 yard line. Penix looks to throw. He's given time. Here's Ty Freifogel left along in the flats. Makes the cut in a big game in the first play for Indiana. Second and six. Penix finds the crosser. It's Ty Freifogel for an Indiana first down. That's a concept the Hoosiers love to run. Back to the air. Against pressure. He's got one on one. Back shoulder throw. It is pulled in by Ty Freifogel. What a catch against Vincent Gray for a gain of 36.
Sometimes football can be fairly complex, and sometimes it could be really simple. That is a one-hander. There they go again. It's another free play, and so an end zone shot. Up top. having a huge first half first down to the 30 five free plays have converted four of those into long completions Penix well protected here on time and rhythm he's got Freifogel for another big game into Michigan territory what a first half Freifogel 32 more now more than 100 yards Penix hits across in five forward. He's inside the 10, down to the 5. A little bit short. Third and one coming up. Brad Hawkins, the tackle. He'll throw here. Wide open along the sideline. It's a first down catch by Freifogel. Second down and eight. Inside seven minutes to go here in the first quarter. And another pass play for Penix. And an on target throw near the first down. Freifogel. That's Fillier who came into the backfield. Penix fakes it to him, throws downfield to Fry Fogel to the 30-yard line. And sliding inside and making the play. Three-year starter, Panachute. Penix from the pocket on second and long. A long throw. Fry Fogel made the catch. Wrapped up at the 25-yard line, so they get a big chunk of it back. Contested catches are part of it. I like the no call, and it's a good play. A swing pass out in space to Fry Fogel. Able to spin out of a tackle. Fry Fogel dies for the end zone touchdown. What a play by Ty Fry Fogel after contact. 13 0 Indiana. And a couple touchdowns. Fry Fogel, after dropping one in the end zone, they come right back to him on the next play. And he is not denied. Picking up right where he left off in last week's. He's a really capable player. Big reason why Indians in this position. On second and 16, Penix. Floats it downfield where it's caught. May have stepped out of bounds, though. Ty Freifogel. You see the official with the cap off. Very soft coverage. They've thrown that out route a couple times. Let's see, maybe they go in that direction again. Penix is looking that way. Freifogel on the catch inside the 10. Out of bounds at the 6. Brown with a tackle. It'll be third and goal from there. You do your expense report, it's 58 cents a mile. Let's get every dollar there with the mileage. Five out to the 25, gain of four. What, what do you make of Michigan, by the way? It's just shocking to see what's happened to the Wolverines. This well, the Spartans bring pressure here. Nope, they back off and rush four. Penix on third down. Long throw. It's caught. Fry Fogel. Nobody going to catch him. All the way for the Indiana touchdown on third and seven. You can see the defender, his eyes in the backfield, no problem. Freifogel's just going to run a vertical route. As you can see, the defender still keeping his eyes inside. But then, his eyes stay inside. He starts to drift a little bit. Penix recognizes that, so he throws it to the outside. Ball's a little low. A heck of a catch by Freifogel, not just securing it. But does AM get a look? Because AM beat Florida, and that's a pretty good win. Great. You know, they lost badly to Alabama early in the year. Third down and eight. Penix complete first down. Guess who? Fry Fogel, his 10th catch, closing in on 200 receiving yards. Second down and 10 at the 25. Penix to throw it on second down. Goes sideline and it's caught. Beautiful throw and an even better catch by Ty Fry Fogel. Second and six at the 24 yard line. Penix over the middle. Caught first down. IU. Penix, Scott's open in the flats, Penix over the middle, caught, Fry Fogel with the burst of speed, Fry Fogel, touchdown IU! He's just going to come right down the middle of the field, but look at the busted coverage here for the Buckeyes. You got two players that go out wide, and then there's nobody in the seam. A missed coverage, and then Fry Fogel turns on the Jets right there. Nice strength to get away from the tackle, and he gets... Gain of 15, first down at the Ohio State 33. 
Penix rolling out of the pocket to a strong hand. Delivers deep down the field. Caught touchdown, Fry Fogel again. He's the free safety in the middle of the field. He cannot bite up in coverage, and that's what he does. And Fry Fogel then turns his route up the field towards the back of the end zone. Beautiful throw from Penix, and Fry Fogel does the rest. Up, getting the feet down, holding up. Right now, big of the fourth. He's thrown for 354 in this one. Sideline caught out of bounds at the 40. Fry Fogel. Only having to snap the football four or five times. First down of the 41. Pinnock's under ma massive pressure. And again, he just delivers the ball. Oh, goodness. Here's Mike Pinnock. Delivers. Oh, Fry Fogel caught it. Touchdown, Indiana. But will this be offensive pass interference? Here's the route on the outside. Fry Fogel and Sean Wade. It's been going on all day. Great battle. They both got hands on each other. The flag comes out, and then it's just like, who is it on? Herb show pressure. Here they come. Penix with a clean pocket. That's a first down. Now the quick toss to Ty Freifogel. He was there, his first reception. Just a bad play there by Sanborn. Tuttle on first down. Downfield as he goes to Freifogel, who goes up and is able to have the contested catch. Man, it's been very physical against Freifogel early on as Williams draws him this time. Burton was on him earlier. Penix, a lefty. Tuttle, a righty. And with the quarterback's hand in this figuring in sometimes. On time and on target. And right at the marker on a gain of nine. Called his place eatery in Indianapolis. And the food is to die for. He knows good food. He loves good food. And got a lot of good food during the quarantine. <laughs> and sacks allowed per game. Tuttle. Long throw to the upside. Complete to Fry Fogel. And a first down for Indiana. Pick up a 20. Clean pocket this time and a great strike. That good arm of Michael Penix finding Fry Fogel. And the reigning Big Ten receiver of the year with a big gain to the 19. Penix has struggled to get a lot of completions here early, but he does find a familiar, friendly target. Shirt Jr. over the middle again, and then a hard hit. Kerner coming in to make the stop on Freifogel after a short game. And now down 28 to 3. There's Freifogel. Penix over the middle, first down, and more. Got tripped up to tie Freifogel. 19 carries, 57 yards last week. Nick Sheridan, the offensive coordinator, told us, though, I was fine with how Steven ran the ball. We've got to block better to Matt's point. First throw for Penix. Caught on the right side. Ty Freifogel. Game of six. A couple of players have creeped up to the line yeah. of scrimmage. It looks like it's man. Middle of the field's open. Play clock winding down. Got the snap away. And in the middle of the field, Freifogel ran into one of his own players, offensive lineman Matthew Bedford. But that still does not prevent the first down pick. Penix looking for eight straight completions. And there it is! Touchdown, Ty Freifogel! And so I want you to watch what Penix does. Perfect, nice step and throw. Forms perfect. He throws him backwards. 6 4 2 12 redshirt junior. Transfer from Utah where he never saw any game action. Nice throw there. Back shoulder to Ty Freifogel. In large part because it's easier to be. Freifogel the catch, short game. That includes a couple of interceptions he's got this year. Big one there at second and ten. A reverse to Ty Freifogel, who cuts up along the hash mark and is shouldered down by Tarheek still, but it brings up third and short after a gain of eight. McCulley all day to throw. Oh, he's got him. Freifogel wide open. 
forced out of bounce by Cross inside the 10. In the Big Ten. So the protection's fine. He knows where he wants to go with the ball right away. It's to the outside. Let's take a look on the All-22 to see if we can see who blew the coverage. Oh, McCulley hitting the Orson. 11-yard play. And now here's a run along the sideline from Freifogel. Nice surge across the 35-yard line. So now on second and 10, McCulley, pretty good protection, goes up top, and it's complete to Freifogel. Now Freifogel across the 40. Freifogel dragged down inside the 30, and Indiana gets the big play it needed. Sets up a third and four for the Hoosiers, their first drive of the game. Ty Freifogel, the motion man, on the jet sweep. Freifogel's got a first down. Spun down across the 35-yard line by Tyler Newbin. First and 10, Indiana.